the time is now like 08 48 a.m that's not how you say that but anyhow i'm here at walmart to pick up an order obviously okay and when i'm at home most of the time i have my sim card they're doing something to my face something that's different about. i don't know if it's like no sleep the skin attacks or what but something is definitely different is it um, no that's not it anyways when i'm at home and i'm connected to my wi-fi um I'm trying to think how much of this do I really want to tell. I'm 15 minutes early, so I got time for a short video. But unplug that. So, and I'm on my laptop, so I, I I've got in back to keeping my phone away from me. Okay, and it actually results in them tearing, like disrupting and corrupting more things. Um, around my house because the, the agents say that they have separation issues and I've told you before that they're using the phone to suggest they use the phone for a lot of things but the primary thing is to suggest that someone's with me and that they have a way of attacking me that's the whole thing that has everything to do with them lying about my location and claiming that I'm with others is always about making sure they can make attacks on my appearance if they weren't trying to make attacks on my appearance. You never hear anything about locations. Like all the location bullshit. And all the things that they do with my phone. That's all to make sure they have a way of manipulating reality and attacking my appearance. Okay. That's, that's what that's about. So lately they've been talking to, you know, applying these curses associated with separation and anxiety. Um, and behind me keeping my phone away from me in my house. When I leave, um, it's so bad to the point that, you know, like occasionally um, there are some things that I could do is just a task made simpler um, by phone. So I keep the phone connected to my home Wi-Fi, even though I have the SIM card removed from it. And um, I, I grab it to check email, really. You know, I don't talk on the phone with nobody or nothing like that. I'm not texting nobody. Um, I also use the phone for journal entries. So that's a big thing. I haven't journaled as much lately. Oh, my stomach. <sighs> Ouch. <sighs> my stomach. So I haven't journaled as much recently. And I'm just talking like the last few days. Um... Yeah. So I put the SIM card in today. Whenever I leave home, obviously, I put the SIM card in in case I need to use the phone while I'm out. Okay. Because I often do like um, price checks and, and little things like whatever I decide to use it for. And um, so I put it in before I leave today. This is not going well. <laughs> I put it in before I leave today. And I get here and they're not allowing it to work because of the, 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 they were playing, they, another thing, while I'm at home and they're calling me others, they're placing me in the lowest frequency. So they're saying I need things to do certain things and that I don't have certain things and that I don't do certain things. Okay. It's to place, place me in a really low category. Okay. Those headspace curses are nothing but categories. I've talked about that before. This shit on my skin that they haven't taken off yet. It has a host. It doesn't want to go back where it belongs. Okay. Same thing with the, the plumbing, fake plumbing issue they tried to give me. And many, many, many other things. Okay. So, um. The frequencies, headspace, categories. They were claiming that I didn't have cell phone service, okay? 
and saying that I didn't have home internet. And this is mostly associated with the house behind mine, that little raggedy ass um, elder and her boyfriend truck driver. Mm -hmm. It's associated with them motherfuckers mostly because they are, um, it's for their op, all the different things that they're doing, all the different um, geographical areas that they're supporting all the impressions and false frequencies that they have populations of people under okay um i i can't blame it on the the um uplifting is because it's much bigger than that remember when i told you um like the shit that they were pulling on the street that i was with that they are represented some type of business or corporation it's the same thing, but now they have these things, these new identities in front of them, and which means that they're trying to get further away from their their who they are, okay? And everything is dependent on constantly attacking my appearance, okay? If they take any fat off, if they um, allow me to burn fat, like, okay, so there's two types of things. Like, there, there's, like, the fat injections and then, like, to change my weight, which you saw me document for years, Um or for a year because they did most of it like the small things that they were doing it wasn't sticking so like when they were giving me fat injections just to combat my activity that wasn't enough in order to get a change a real change in my appearance they had to go overboard so you saw me document that for a year straight but for years you've heard me talk about the fat injection ordeal remote inoculation okay so um oh my stomach um uh, uh, uh. yeah if they start removing things from me removing attacks from me um inst internal and external because you can imagine that for me to have any of this external um manifestation that there's things taking place inside okay so they're attacking my dna inside they're attacking me from within all right um Yeah, if um, they go the opposite way, that means that those identities begin to decline, okay? So those that they inverted, the, what they've made them into, all this re-imaging and making them these new things, the, the, establishing their new reality, it, 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 they start looking more like themselves. They start feeling more like themselves. They start acting more like themselves, okay? Um I feel like I've gotten off the topic. <laughs> so the frequency thing, cell phone. They were claiming I didn't have cell phone service, okay? And that my home internet that I've been using wasn't my home internet. Um, and there's a lot of things that go along with that. So I'm just going to show you real quick that I'm here. Hopefully it works now because I've sat here a minute and been, what, how many minutes am I into this video? Okay, still not working. They aren't letting up. So look, this is, uh, well, I've always had phone service. But literally every time that I came to Walmart, when I had Boost Mobile, I still connected to their Wi-Fi. They've been complaining about me long, no longer using Walmart's Wi-Fi and that it is causing, like, you see things shift around me when I get go in the store, like, behind this alone, like, not collect, connecting to their Wi-Fi and them acting like they just discovered that I have phone service. Okay, so anyways, I'm not letting up on this. I'm not connected to their Wi-Fi. I'll call the fucking number and tell them what spot I'm in before I do that. Um, but I am going to restart my phone because I just put the SIM in. And um, hope it starts working like it's supposed to. Um, I think that's it for now. This host thing, though. It, it's so weird, like... You know, I've been watching like some old shows lately, like old movies, old shows. And um, it's so weird because like when I look at some of this stuff and I'm like, those terms were entered. I'm either like, 
I thought this term was more recent and it was introduced that long ago or it's like look at how my like I have that word in my vocabulary and I, I, it's like being reintroduced to it never be like not being able to access it not being able to access the memory associated with it um the host when speaking in terms of spirit you've never heard me say it prior to now like you'll see the title in some of my um videos but host okay like all, all my life <laughs> of when speaking in terms are either watching you know you can you can pick up this shit from watching movies Cause even when I spoke with like um like growing up like through over the years like spoke with people about like um this the spiritual side of things the spiritual realm and like even talking about demons and possession and stuff like that like host never really came into the conversation because we were never really talking about anything attaching itself to someone or something. So that's the term that I picked up from movies and I've watched some old movies and I'm like, why didn't I, wasn't I able, but it's the same thing. You saw that in 2017, you saw that in 2018, you hear me saying something similar, very similar to what I'm saying now about how I've um, been regarding um, some of the things that are taking place and just not being able to access my vocabulary. Host, all this shit. All this shit has a host, okay? It belongs to some fucking body else. 